Most people in America are familiar with the tunnel vision that people have about their life. They get so restricted in what they're thinking that they don't realize that what they're thinking is either illegal, immoral, or illicit. They don't like that people move in and out of their opportunities because they created those opportunities not for you and not for me, but for themselves. The truth is that people like to steal opportunities from others and they do it with such a squeal that they think they're clever. They think they're so clever. They call it cleverness in Harry Potter that she is so clever. Not really. A woman named Cindy in a shop is not clever, but she thinks she is. And openly she's teaching her friends and her family to mesmerize people in her wicked ways. Now, is that something we need for the rest of our days? The answer is no. But when someone steals from you a pocket knife because they enter your tent, unzip your pockets, and steal from you, it's not right. When someone is a distractor in order for someone to be a pickpocket, that is also immoral and illegal. But is that you? In America, we have rights, and when you chose to abate your rights by allowing other people to steal in front of you, you destroyed your own rights to God. You lied to yourself about what you're doing here, and isn't it interesting that the little girl that's been cyber hacking me all of the time applied herself today to say, nanny nanny boo boo, it's me and you're mine. But the funny part about it is that she was captured on film, and yet that piece of footage is now missing off a man's computer. Doesn't that exactly prove that she was doing that and entering a person's opportunities and ruining it or entering someone's bedroom and abusing it? And never once was she invited to be anywhere close to a man like me and never once was she invited anywhere close to taking away my opportunities. Apparently, one of the employees here is no longer here. Now, is that because he spouted his mouth off and got pummeled by someone? Or is that because someone finally in law enforcement took him off for his sexual assaults and his abuse and his harassment of people like me? Or did they do that just long enough so that that person will come out of that jail more pissed off at me? The liars of America like to make litigation abuse, like to track people's purchases so they can steal it back. It's a game they like to play, but the most amusing thing about people who are novice at lying is that they don't look right when they lie. Their face changes, their face shifts, and when they're trying to have posture again in a situation when they have technically no legal posture, no legal leeway, they often make missteps, and that's what happens to people. Not like me, but possibly like your employees.